we're suffering an epidemic of loneliness. So many people are so lonely. So many people don't have even one close person in their life with whom they can open their hearts, with whom they can really share. And that lack of connection is one of the greatest causes of depression, of anxiety, of addiction, even of physical illness. They've connected rate of loneliness and physical immunity. So we need to learn how to reconnect, not just online. Friends on Facebook don't count. Followers online don't count. We have to have real connection. But a lot of us don't even know how. Maybe we've forgotten in the years of social media or in the years of being so focused on career that we have forgotten how to actually make good friends. The first and most important aspect and the best way to be a good friend and to make good friends is to open your own heart, to share of yourself with others. If you're just putting on a show, telling a story, playing a role, trying to impress someone, you're not actually going to connect with them deeply, which means that that heart-to-heart -heart connection won't be there. You'll just impress them. But as we all know, impressing somebody doesn't actually fill our hearts. Only that love-to-love -love deep connection does. So when you meet someone, when you are going deeper in a friendship, share. Share the depth of who you are. Share vulnerably. Share with courage. Share with honesty who you are. Because if you don't let people see who you are, how can they love who you are? How can they actually be friends with who you are if you don't show it to them? So number one, show who you are. Number two, Try to pull gently, lovingly from the other person who they are. Be interested. Ask questions, deep questions, and then listen when they share. Don't be, you know, scrolling on your phone because some message has come while somebody's talking to you. And of course, you don't want to do this in the first five minutes of meeting someone. People may be a little bit put off. But as you are deepening in a friendship, as you realize that this is someone who really could be a good friend, share yourself and then create a space of acceptance, of interest, of patience, of understanding, of non-judgment for the other person then to share of themselves. And slowly you will refine that joy, that health of deep friendship and deep connection.